Hi, Gene Burnett from GeneBurnett.com. Hey, I thought we'd talk a little bit about throwing today. I know a lot of my uh, friends are getting rotator cuff injuries and, 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 and shoulder problems and neck stuff, and some of them are, are uh, weekend warriors who get out and play softball and baseball and throw stuff, and they say, oh, I can't throw like I used to, and my, rope, my shoulder went out. And I think uh, this is an interesting way to approach this. It's kind of a Tai Chi way of throwing. Um, Typical throwing, I'm going to just do this left hand so you can see it. Typical throwing involves kind of a whip action like this. And so there's this kind of sending this whip through the arm. And you notice, our, you know, in Tai Chi we talk about a bow right here or a circular shape in here. They break that bow. It breaks wide open and then it closes to do the throw. And if it's extreme, you see this version where the, it's way back here and then it kicks forward like that. So you've got this extreme opening. And you know, that might be fine and necessary and good if you want to throw as hard as you possibly can. Or if you're a pitcher in the major leagues, especially making millions and millions of dollars. You know, you're going to blow your arm out in a few years. You're going to need surgery. Uh, you're not going to pitch complete games. Uh, you're going to be on a pitch count. And you're going to be overdoing it or close to overdoing it and maybe needing surgery, but you know, you make the millions of dollars, I understand the sacrifice, really. But if you're just a regular person and you'd like to throw, and you'd like to throw for the rest of your life, and, and use throwing as a, as a pleasant activity to maybe mirror back to you your body's state and how you're feeling and all that good stuff, you want to use it as a little bit of a spiritual practice, then uh, this way of throwing might not be the best one for you if you want to avoid those surgeries. So. I have a, a, a videotape in my uh, Tai Chi library of um, Nolan Ryan teaching uh, uh, how to throw a fastball. And this is a, a little bit of uh, tips from him and just stuff that I've uh, figured out myself. But if you think of the bow here, you've got that circle, you, open, you bring the bow back and you bring the bow forward. So you're doing this. You're not doing this. Uh, there. I'll try the, I'll throw it the other way, I'm a little better with my right hand. But you've got your bow here, and you bring it forward. You've got it here, forward. And I can throw pretty freaking hard this way. And it's no problem on the arm or shoulder at all. This is fine. As opposed to here, like that, where you're doing this action, and man, even just doing it in air, I start to feel some tug and tenderness on my rotators. So instead here, look at that, man. I mean, if you were, I don't know if you can hear it, but I can hear it. Like I can hear this whoosh as my arm goes by. It has a little bit of power to it. I'm not saying this is the best way to make a million dollars as a baseball pitcher, but if you play with this idea when you're just throwing uh, for fun with your kids or with your friends just hanging out, playing catch is one of the great pleasures in life, you know? So if you can keep that bow and then just bring it forward like that instead of this, you might have less pain and more ease and be able to throw longer, maybe even better. I haven't tested this competitively because I'm not on any teams or anything, but I do like to play catch, I do like to throw, I do like to throw left and right handed, so this does apply there too. Just make sure you let your right hand lead the way, you know, and then throw. Don't try to feel like this, you know. <laughs> you notice on this hand, the left hand leads the way for the right. So on this hand, the right hand leads the way for the left. So you get that. So thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Uh, if you like this kind of thing, subscribe to my channel or visit jeanburnett.com. I have lots of music and uh, nature and Tai Chi videos and all kinds of stuff on my channel here. So thanks for watching. Appreciate it.